Hey you guys, it's Mr. Sal. Let's go ahead and do number two on the practice test for chapters one and two. Number two is asking which of the following are whole numbers. For these to be whole numbers, what we really need is for them to be positive. And they can't be uh, in the form of a fraction or have a decimal unless it's being a, a fraction with a denominator of one or the decimal has a zero and only zeros after the decimal. So if we look at these, let's look at the first one, five. It's not in fractional form and it doesn't have any decimals, so that will be one of our answers there. The second value, two thirds right here, that is a fraction where the denominator three is not one, so this one is not included. The third value here, negative 21, is negative, so it's not included either. 10.255 has a decimal with some other value than zero, so this one also is not included. 56 is not in fractional form, and it doesn't have any decimals, so it is a whole number. 149 also, it's not a fraction, has no decimals showing, so it also is a whole number. 9 fifths, this one is a fraction where the denominator is not 1, so it is not included. And finally, 288 negative has a negative, so it cannot be a whole number. And our answer for this one is just 556 and 149.